in the heart of the Word. Reflections by Father Joseph Mary, SCTJM, on the daily readings from the Holy Mass, Monday of the 28th week of Ordinary Time, Memorial of St. Margaret Mary Alacoque, Virgin. God bless you, dear family. Today in the heart of the Word, Jesus asks us to hear His voice and to obey His command. In the Gospel, Jesus speaks to the crowds, comparing their generation to the Queen of the South, who came from the ends of the earth to hear the wisdom of Solomon, and to Nineveh, who repented at the preaching of the prophet Jonah. Then Jesus says something very important to them. He says, there is something greater than Jonah here, and there is something greater than Solomon here. Through these words, Jesus is saying that he is greater than all of the wisdom of the Old Testament, Solomon, and all of the prophets of the Old Testament, Jonah. But where does our Lord's greatness come from? Today we celebrate the memorial of St. Margaret Mary Alacoque, to whom Jesus revealed his sacred heart in three public apparitions. Jesus desired for St. Margaret Mary to spread the devotion to his sacred heart so that he could pour out the treasures of his mercy, grace, peace, and sanctification upon all men and women who for the most part treat him with coldness and gratitude and irreverence because of the sacrileges and contempt he receives in the sacrament of his love which is the Holy Eucharist. By revealing his most sacred heart, Jesus' essential message calls for repentance, reparation, and consolation. My brothers and sisters, in our generation, even amid so many difficulties and so much violence, there is still something, there is still someone who is greater, the love of the heart of Jesus. The love of his most sacred heart is greater than all of our sins, our trials, and all the violence and tragedy that we see. With a profound spirit of prayer and trust and repentance, let us open our hearts to receive the treasures of his heart by hearing his voice and obeying his command and bringing his peace to our brothers and sisters. Let us listen to these words of Mother Adela. The love of the heart of Jesus is an open door and fountain of salvation. Only if we let ourselves be inflamed by that love can we build a new civilization where love triumphs. Our Lady Queen of Peace, pray for us. St. Margaret Mary, pray for us. All for the heart of Jesus, through the heart of Mary.